Hi everyone, we're working on a 2006 Nissan Altima and we're working on the crankshaft position sensor. We had two codes. We had a PO335, which is a crankshaft position sensor signal, and then we had PO725 engine speed signal. The crankshaft position sensor is located in the rear of the engine and it is back in the back of the cylinder block up here in this area. Now, I looked at the connector and the connector has quite a bit of damage to it. If you look at the connector there, you can see the screwdriver scratch marks on it. You can see here where it's been pushed in, overextended. It's all scratched up in here. It's very difficult to slide. It was in that position. That's the unlocked position. And so it's not connected properly. So then when I took it off the sensor, the sensor's got all kinds of dirt along the side here. There's an O-ring right here where it's broken the O-ring. And if you flip it around to the other side, the O-ring's deformed. The sensor wasn't able to slide all the way in. <clears throat> so what someone kept doing is they kept tightening it down. And I don't know if we can see it on this side or not. But they actually cracked the back of the housing. I think you can see the crack there where the bolt goes in. Let me set it up here. There's a crack right alongside here because it wasn't in and they kept tightening it down. So there's a lot of technical service things about it. It doesn't apply to this particular vehicle. They talk about oil being the connector. There's no oil inside this connector. But someone has obviously changed this and what happened with all this dirt on the outside, the connector could not plug all the way in. Then once you plug it onto the new sensor, that green tab, when it plugs on the sensor, that green lock will snap back to this higher area here. It'll be flush with the end of this black plastic housing. So it was never connected properly because of all the dirt inside there. So it couldn't connect properly. The sensor was not installed properly. As you can see all the damage to the O-ring and how it wasn't seated. And then they actually bent this a little bit and they cracked the bolt that holds it in. So I've got a new sensor coming over from Nissan. We're gonna put a new sensor in it, clear the code, properly install the connector, clean everything up, and that should take care of this consumer's problem. But someone's gone in there and worked before, and the work they did before, when you look at that connector, you can see it's very substandard. Um, it's not anything like the vehicle came. And so you want to restore things to the most optimal condition back to a factory standard. That's nowhere close. So thank you very much and have a nice day.